Hey guys and dolls. Sorry Tommy J can't come to the internet right now. Uh, but if you care to leave a message, they'll be happy to get back to you when there's a lot more to report. Uh, just thought I'd give you a little update on what's going on. We are making, this is the old, uh, there's a little light over there. That's the old tent there. That's the x back cave. It was going to become the veg and flower tent. However, we decided just to do a little extra bump out. So we've torn all the walls out in here. And uh, right now, got uh, framing going up to hold the lights. The lights are gonna be pretty bitchin'. Uh, we're running uh, along this 20 foot section all up in here. Uh, we're gonna be running four AC uh, double ended. And so we dropped some uh, 20 amp service in. This is just for the regular part of the garage. As a favor to the friend who's letting this temporary thing go up, I'm gonna put four bays in. And then this area in here where the tent is, is gonna actually wind up being uh, the veg area. So that'll be the section that serves the four flower sections. You're running a DWC in here. The water heater, this kind of stuff's going out, but we'll have counter here and a uh, sink, uh, obviously uh, running DWC, you need your access to your water. But uh, yeah, things are, things are changing out here in the back cave. So just thought we'd uh, let you in on the groove and I hope to be getting some footage from the place. Yeah, all this stuff will be out of here where I'm standing right now will be a bed that I'll be able to hang out in. And, uh, Right now, I got my chair out here. I'm in charge. That's it. I'm, uh, I'm not actually doing the stuff. There's uh, other humans that are much more capable. I'm letting them know what to do. And that's uh, my throne where I sit. We're getting the back cave built and looking forward to having some things to share with you. All right, guys and dolls, peace out. So that's where the lights are going to run along. And the edge area will be there. And I'll have a place set up for my chair. And I'll just sit here and wait for harvest. That's what's going on in the back cave, guys and dolls. And we got... OSB half inch going up to the walls and that's uh, so we'll be able to screw anything so we're gonna get this 20 feet of wall here and work our ways around but the new bat cave is officially starting here we go 20 feet of flowering wall so there'll be four Five by five bays along here. So just working it through. The back cave is coming alive. Hey guys and dolls, Dabe Kahuna, Tommy J coming to you from the back cave. We're starting to get things put together here. Getting some walls put up. Uh, this whole section in front of the door is going to get covered up. Uh, but that's the 20 foot wall back there. I've been I've been relegated to a um, Fortunately, we had the tent on wheels. We've been moving that around. It's not a problem. But uh, so yeah, wall in front of uh, the garage door here. 
And this area that I'm standing in is veg, and then along there now, that whole 20 feet flower. And we've got the walls going up here, so we have some holes for ventilation, which is using existing. We'll wind up running, a, my plan is CO2. We'll see if we get there, guys and dolls, but uh, that's the plan where to go. And I uh, have another sheet to put up here, and then all the wires are down there. We're running the, uh, there'll be switches for cam lights, you know, for the kind of common area, we'll call it. And then a back board that was put up for holding the uh, the, the air-cooled uh, double-ended uh, HPS bulbs are going to go up on there. So that's what's in this. This shelf is just sitting here, just have music on it for right now, and all that will be out of there because there's a wall that comes right along, right about to where this uh, tent is here. So that that will be a whole wall of flower, and then there's a room for veg, and there'll be a bed in here because, yep, this is old fart grows, and old fart's got to lay down. Or or lay back in this, or something like that, you know, in between uh, medication runs, or going to call it. And uh, in here will be counter and sink uh, for working on plants, and, you know, a microwave, and uh, down there will be a, you know, a mini fridge. It's a man cave! Man cave and the back cave. So, uh, that is the view from here. See you later, guys and dolls. Hey, guys and dolls. Got Big Kahuna, Tommy J, coming to you from the back cave. So we've got a lot of the walls up. All the walls we need to get up to uh, get the uh, grow stuff in here. So you've seen some of this already. Just updating, we've got the corners done in there top along the garage door, there'll be the wall, we'll show you that, uh, go, an insulated wall going over the garage door, um, but right now we're working on the ceiling, we'll do this garage door thing later, so we're just putting in uh, last couple uh, nailers uh, to hold the, the lid up, we're putting half inch OSB up top, going to have a couple of cans for lighting in here, one, two, Three, four. Uh, this one will uh, not have a bulb in it because this is actually be the veg. But when this turns back into a man cave, it's what that's for. And then up in here, we'll have a uh, light here above the sink, and we'll have a light here above the window. So this will be closed off along there, and then coming along here. So uh, getting it done. Monkey Boy's up in the rafters again. So just have these last couple nailers uh, while we're putting the lid up. Uh, putting those cans in, we'll put the wiring over for the lights. We're gonna have security lights and stuff in here, obviously, you know, protect the children. Okay, have a groovy day, guys and dolls. Okay, guys and dolls, this is the end of the day. I can't do any more. <laughs> I can't lay back in the chair and direct what to do anymore. I'm, I'm at, but I've, I've helped some. So all the lumber's up in the ceiling. Some of it carries the lights. Others, you know, just screwed up there for uh, nailers. So that's all done. So tomorrow the uh, ceiling goes up with the cam lights in it. The wiring gets finished through and down there. And we uh, another light. So the Man cave wiring will be done. We'll be bringing in a separate power line to power the uh, lights and the AC units and everything in here. So that's where we are at the end of the day. And it's time for Godbe Kahuna to lay down. Getting there. See you guys and dolls. Hey guys and dolls. Godbe Kahuna, Tommy J, coming to you from the new man cave back cave. So what's happening today is the lid goes on. So you see we got nothing up here. No insulation, no anything, got a little bit of wires. So this is what we're starting today in. We got a little bit of sunshine outside. We'll be covering that up. That won't be getting in here anymore. So this is 
the plan. Get that lid on, get the different can lights in, get the cans in over the sink area and counter uh, for spotlighting that. And then we're gonna put that wall up all along here and put this wall up. That's my plan is to get to those walls. Uh, it's a 10 day delay. Was gonna just run the uh, tent while I did some other work, but we had a little change of plans. And for a 10 day delay, I go from just this four by eight tent, which was gonna be veg and flour, to I'll have that much room for veg alone, and I'll have four lights uh, for flour. So, here we go again, guys and dolls. Wish me luck. My son's really tired. See if we can uh, get to it and we'll get through it. Peace out. Love yous. All right, well, as you can see, the lid is finally starting to go up. I uh, was without my helper most of the day, so I finished the wiring, but uh, now the lid is starting to go up and there'll be, you know, cleat boards in the edges, not finished carpentry stuff here. It's a man cave. So, up it goes. So I just got the rest of the Botswana to do. And we'll get up as much as we need to turn a light on. This 10 day delay is about to be slayed. Okay guys and dolls. Hey guys and dolls, Dabe Kahuna, Tommy J, coming to you from the man cave and the bat cave here. This is just a little update on uh, how to handle cannabis carpentry. So, you, you know, the sun's out, so the rain's passed, you can get the wood out and get outside and uh, do your cuts because it's just a few pieces that need going up in the ceiling here. Everything's groovy. Show up, get the tarps pulled off. Uh, everything's dry, ready to go. Got my tape measure out. Measured my first cut. That, that you're looking at a 43 and uh, uh, three eighths there. That's exactly what that is. And uh, so I'm all ready to go. You know, I, I get right with the world. You know, I'm down here alone today. So you know, I got that stuff uh, handled from the uh, from the last back cave. It's uh, what's been building this back cave. All this stuff just winds up with me. <laughs> um, so, stuff in the last back cave, got that handled, ready to go draw my line, and there's one problem. Don't have a Sharpie. Had several Sharpies around here, can't find a Sharpie, and after dealing with this, there's no way I'm getting in the vehicle and driving somewhere to get one. I just, I don't do that. <laughs> so, uh, Cannabis Carpentry 101, find your Sharpie, before you spark and uh, things will be going groovy, but that's what's going on here in the back cave. Just to, uh, I mean, I'm, I'm like right there, I'm ready to, to put them up and I don't have a Sharpie and I'm high. <laughs> Hi there guys and dolls. Oh, well, see you later. Bye bye. Well, maybe there is a God. I found a Sharpie. So uh, you can breathe. Uh, things are going to be happening here in the back cave today. I'll give you an update in a little while. Peace out. Hey guys and dolls. Well, had big plans for today. I was finishing the rest of the ceiling. It's not done. I did get uh, this one 4x4 four four section in and drilled, I mean, uh, jigged out for the can, got the can wired in, and this section over here where all the wires were in the back, I got that one little section of wall on, got all the wiring done there, uh, put an outlet in here. I just have to hook that up to hot, but that's all set, so this will do the uh, two cans that are going over the sink and counter here. Uh, this one does the four that are down the middle. 
and then this one will have a cover on it. This is just in case you have to work on the outside lights. Uh, that puts the lights outside the garage on. So that was all I got done. I've been here since 2. It's 6 o'clock. Uh, this is why we need help because Old Fart grows, but Old Fart can't do much else. <laughs> I, am, I just can't hang out on the ladders and everything like I did before. So we're getting there. And uh, got swept up, got you know, a couple things cleaned up. Obviously, I didn't, uh, I just finished, wanted to show off. Ha! Huh? Um, just didn't finish cleaning up the wires there, but swept most of the floor. And tomorrow we come back and right in around here at the five foot mark uh, for the whole 20 feet, we're gonna put the wall in and then across here at five and a half feet going up to that other wall will be the veg area and I'll put that in tomorrow and we'll show you some more of that so guys and dolls da big kahuna tommy j uh, signing out for the day